You too. My name is Trey. Welcome to Work Out Change. Pearl Davis, Hannah Pearl Davis. I did not want to make a video on her, but let's just go ahead and get right into the topic. So as you guys know, uh, Miss Hannah here, or Pearl, what she likes to go by, has been really on a tweet and spree, crazy one. You know, getting into arguments with shoe on head and then just making some crazy, crazy tweets, okay? I understand she has a belief, but what people are starting to say is that she's kind of doing this to be kind of a grifter. She's just kind of trying to get some engagement because Twitter does pay and she knows her YouTube views are going down. Uh, so she's trying to kind of push this thing on there. I'm fine with that. I don't really care. But she made this post earlier. I did not know that she had already deleted it. I thought she would stick with it, but she didn't. So as you can see, I follow this individual who's against pornography and has been fighting Pornhub for a very long time. Um, and I, I, uh, I've been following her for a while now. So she says, Pearl really did put this up. I saw this earlier and I thought to myself, wow, that's crazy. And I thought she'd keep it up, but I wasn't going to talk about it. But now that she deleted it, I got to talk about it because some people will never know. So she said 16 year old chicks are hotter than six, 26 year old chicks. Um, so the biggest argument against this earlier when I was reading the comments, when I first saw this tweet is that it, the age of consent in a lot of states is 16. If, believe it or not, it is. In fact, I want to say a little bit over the majority of the age of consent is 16. Um, then there's 17 and then there's 18. But it's not uncommon for people to, you know, get married and all that kind of stuff at 16 in these other states that is allowed. I want to say this. Pearl deleted it because there were some weirdos in the comments. I also want to say this. I don't understand what Pearl is getting at. If y'all have seen Pearl just tweeting randomly, she also made a, she got on the guitar, played some music. People said she was a great singer. And then she started rapping and then saying, you know, hey, I'm a great rapper and all this kind of stuff. And I know she was being joking. She was being facetious. But she just kept doing all this weird stuff. Like she was tweeting so much. I was shocked. I mean, shocked. I started following Pearl because somebody had created a fake account of her. So I wanted to make sure I never looked at another fake account of her. So I followed the real Hannah Pearl. And now here we are. She posts so much in her Twitter. It just fills up my feed. It's insane. And she just keeps saying off the wall stuff. Some stuff people go with. Some people stuff, stuff people go against. Obviously, I am not saying that she should be promoting underage teens. To say that, she is talking about 16, which is the age of consent in some states. If I wish to say that was sick, I, I mean, I can't because then I would have to be going against those states. It is the age of consent in those areas. But it is odd that she would say something like 16-year-old 16 chick, 16 chicks are hotter than 26-year-olds. That is where it's disturbing to me. It's one thing to bring up 16-year-olds if you want to talk about age of consent and the laws, but what I, I, I just don't personally look at a 16-year-old and go, wow, she's way hotter than a 26-year-old. It just sounds gross. It sounds like an Adam 22 thing, to be honest. When Adam would talk about this kind of stuff back in the day, it just comes off as kind of sick. And there's a reason she deleted it. Maybe she's finally starting to see you can't just start saying all this off-the-wall stuff. People are going to keep coming after it. Pearl, Pearl, you've got to calm down. I understand when to make money. Get your views up. Get everything going for you. I get it. Make your money. I'm not here to be against the bag. Even though I don't agree with a lot of stuff you say, that's fine. Okay, we all have our place in this world. But you do not seem genuine. You seem disingenuous in the stuff you say. You just say stuff to get a rise out of people. The fact that you tweet so much lets me know you are trying to get engagement and trying to get that money. You got to calm down. Pearl, this, this social media fame, and we see this happen time and time and time again. When some people get this social media fame, they think they're one of the most famous people on earth. They just, they can't handle it. And I truly believe that Pearl cannot handle this level of fame that she has now. She has taken it. She could have taken it to a good place, but she just takes it to just get on women, get on feminists, and to say stuff like this. I think she's slowly starting to crack with all this fame. Where did she go from here? I have no idea. But I have seen this. I told you guys, I am a nosy person. I look into this stuff. I look into people's TikToks. And I just, because in TikToks, you're really going to see people state of mind. But I look into people's stuff and I see when some people get fame or a little notoriety, dude, they crack underneath that. This is the problem with being young sometimes getting the fame. 
Now, Pearl is 26 turning 27, I believe. So she's old enough to understand this. So I don't understand what's going on with her. But we do see this in younger people, especially people who are 16, 17, 18, 19. They start getting that fame really young. They do the wildest, craziest things to try to keep that fame, keep the money coming. And they have all these people in their ear doing the same thing. Pearl is older. I think she's starting to realize that if she doesn't do something, she's going to end up fading away because the red pill feminist stuff is only going to last so long. But y'all let me know what y'all think. 16-year-old being hotter than a 26-year-old. If a man was to say that, would that not be one of the creepiest things on earth to hear?